Hey, ho, it's Sooty and Ho. Everybody say hello. There's Sooty and Sweep, a panda called Sue, and little cousin Scampy too. They'll be fun galore with the terrible four. Just you wait and see. It's Sooty and Company. Sooty and Company. Oh, he hello there. Welcome to Sooty and Co, the friendly store which sells everything. Or we would if there are any customers. Actually, that's why we're putting this bell up here, because we may be missing customers whilst we're having tea in the back. Sooty's meant to be lending a pause. Oh, he's here. Right, come, come on over here, Sooty. Come on. Oh, I see you've got the screws, yes? Well, look who's here. Look. Wave to them. Go on, wave. You've just dropped the screws on the floor. You go and get them. No, 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 no. Come, come back here. Come back here. Look, there's no time for that. I've got some nails, all right? You go and get the hammer. It's down there. Go on, bring it up. Right, uh, I'll hold the nail here and you, you hit it. Listen, don't do that. Be careful. <clears throat> right, just hit that. Ready? Go. Get on my finger. <sighs> Try again. We're going to have to get together on this. I'll count one, two, three, then I'll nod my head. And when I nod my head, you hit it. It's like meeting an old friend, isn't it? Got it? Good. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, hit it. Ow! Oh, I think I'm going to have a lie down. I think I need a lie down. Well, to be honest, I think it's a bit of a silly idea anyway. What is? A bell pulled by a bit of string. I mean, who thought of that? Well, actually, Sue, I did. Oh. Anyway, it's better than Sooty's original idea, because originally he didn't want a bell on the end of the piece of string. Oh, no. What? What did he want on the end of the string? I'll show you. Hang on. Up. <coughs> it's sweet. That's right. Well, I do see Sooty's point, Matthew. I mean, you could hardly miss that noise. Hmm? Well, that's true, but relax, Sweep. You're off the hook. He's not going to do it. As a matter of fact, we're fixing the bell up. Sooty should be doing it now. As a matter of fact, he should have finished, so uh, cheers, Sooty. <laughs> That's the bell! That's the customer! Stay here! I'm free! I'm free! Yes, sir or madam, how can I help you? Can I interest you in some really nice... Ah! Look at that! Sooty and he's, he's got the string around his foot! Uh, take it easy, take it easy, Sooty. Don't, don't, don't panic. I'll panic for both of us. Look at that, all the blood rushing to his head. Look, hang on, don't, don't, don't struggle, don't, don't struggle. I get the... Take it, oh, take it easy. No, 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 don't, don't struggle. Sooty, don't, don't, don't struggle. Don't struggle. Let me get the string off your foot. Get it off. Right, come on, come on. There we are now. Are you okay? Good as new, I'm pleased to say. Oi, oi, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hitting the bell. But why, why are you hitting the bell? Because it caused all the trouble. Uh, just a minute, just a minute, Sooty, you can't blame the bell. I mean, the bell is just a lump of metal. You don't like silly old lumps of metal. What do you mean? What do you mean you don't like silly old lumps of metal? Look, I feel I ought to correct you on one point. Metal is not silly. Oh, no. You see, metal can be very valuable. As a matter of fact, even scrap metal can be valuable. Oh, yes. Mark my words, Sooty, there's real money to be made out of scrap metal. Real money. So let me get this straight, Sooty. <coughs> Matthew said that metal is worth money. <coughs> yes, even scrap metal, Sooty. <coughs> Could we make money out of scrap metal? Well, I suppose we could. <coughs> Lots of money. <coughs> well, yes, I suppose so, Sweep. If only we could think of where to find any scrap metal. Now, let's think. <coughs> Are you thinking what <coughs> I'm thinking, boys? <coughs> Stand aside, boys, there's a panda at work. Ha! Huh. Who says women can't be plumbers? <laughs> One thing's for sure, it certainly wasn't me.
finished. Hey, shh. Listen to this sound. Does that ring a bell? <laughs> Does that ring a bell? That's <laughs> a great one, isn't it? <laughs> Thank you, fans. Thank you, fans. <laughs> That's brilliant. Brilliant. Ah, hello, Sue. Hello. Is that a little tap you've got there? Yes. Yes? Are you thinking about doing some tap dancing? Oh. <laughs> tap dancing? <laughs> They're all coming out today, aren't they? No, Matthew. <laughs> We're well, planning on making some uh, money. That's what? what. Are you? Bring it up, boys. Bring what? Uh, oh, just a minute, just a minute. What's all this stuff? What is this stuff? Huh? Scrap metal? That's right, Matthew. We're going to make a fortune, aren't we, boys? Uh, just, just, just a minute. This is not scrap metal. Uh, sweep, those are the door handles from upstairs. And Sue, those are my bath taps. Mm. And this... Well, I don't really like to say what this is. What are you doing with all this stuff? Hmm? You're going to sell it here in the shop? You can't. We can. And when we've sold that lot, there's plenty more where that came from. We've been very busy, haven't we, boys? Yes, well, you can just be busy again and take this lot back. Go on, take it back. Oh, no, now, you. go on, do it now. Take it back. Put oh. it all back. Honestly, scrap metal. I'm going for a cup of tea. <laughs> Fancy them thinking they could sell all those things. They are silly. Where's the kettle? I don't suppose you've seen it, have you? big metal kettle. Oh, that's such a meanie. I'm sure we could have made a fortune selling this old kettle of scrap metal. Aren't you? Yes. This is ridiculous. Not only can I not find the kettle, but I can't find the teapot either. You haven't seen it about so big, made of metal? You bet this would have made a fortune. You're right, sweet. This teapot is one of the finest examples of scrap metal I've ever seen. Mm. I can't believe this. No teaspoons. In fact, there is no cutlery at all. Do you know, it's as if a great big magnet has just come down and sucked anything which is metal. Up. Metal! I think I know where it's all gone. That's the bell! Let's go! There's a, a customer! Ah! Ah! Oh. Who are you? Well, well, we, uh, we, uh, we... Who are we? Who are... What? Oh, yes, we work here. Uh, and you must be... I'm Mo. No, you must be... No, I'm Mo, Mo from the market. No, Mo. No. You are not simply Mo from the market. You must be a customer. Oh, well, yes, I see what you mean. I suppose I am a customer. Well, I would be if you lot would just stop staring and serve me. All right, right, action stations. OK, action. What, what can we do you for? I mean, what can we do for you? Oh, well, <laughs> yes. Now, I've got quite a long list here, you see. Great. Well, you know, far ahead. Well, I don't suppose you've got such a thing as a tap. Tap. Yes, you know the thing you turn on and water comes out. Uh, no, my friend, that's the one thing which we don't actually have. Oh, have... oh a tap! Uh, no, 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 sorry, that's, uh, that's not for sale. Oh, sorry. all right, sorry. Then. <laughs> Now, have you got a door handle? A uh, door handle? Ah. Um, I'm, I'm afraid... Oh, we... a door handle! No, no, yeah. no, 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 I'm sorry, that's not available. Oh. Sorry, sorry about that. Well, <laughs> have you got the sort of thing that goes inside the you-know-what, you know? What? what? Yes, I want one No, 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 we're fresh out of those, sorry. No. No, none of those at all, sorry. Have you got a large kettle? Um, no. Uh, definitely not. Sorry about that. Sorry. A metal teapot? D no, we're fresh out of metal teapot. We have got no metal teapots, I'm well, sorry. Well, what about a nice set of metal cutlery? A metal cutlery? We have... No, no, we have got no metal cutlery. I'm sorry, madam. No, it's Mo. Oh, Mo. Uh, well, in that case, no, Mo. We have got nothing metal whatsoever. Well, you should have. What? Because there's money to be made out of metal, even out of scrap metal, which is why yes, you should invest in one of these. A mini metal detector. There. Yours for 20 quid. Take it or leave it. Well, I don't think we want it to... John! What? Well, we certainly have been. There's big money to be made out of scrap metal. Mark my words. <laughs> big money. <laughs> No, I already explained, Sweep. We couldn't possibly sell her those things because they belong to us. <coughs> anyway, since my partner here bought this metal detector, <coughs> you can jolly well go off and make your fortunes collecting scrap metal, all right? I'll put the metal detector in the back for you. 
God. Right. Off you go. Go on. <laughs> you know, there's real money in scrap metal. Mark my words. So off went Sooty and Sweep with their new toy to look for valuable scrap metal, leaving Sue and Scampy and me looking after the shop. After a few minutes, they came upon a likely looking place. Come on, said Sweep. Let's get started. So they set off with the metal detector, looking to make their fortune by finding scrap metal. Tell me if you hear it go beep, said Sooty. That will mean that we've struck gold, or a deposit of aluminium at least. I heard something, I heard something. It went beep, said Sweet. Right, said Sooty. Let's start digging. So they did. This is no good, said Sooty. We'll be at this all day. Leave it to me, said Sweet. And he started to dig like only a dog knows how. I found something! I found something! said Sweep. And sure enough, he had a milk bottle top, said Sooty. Have another look. I'm sure there must be something else down there. So, Sweep had another look. A bit more digging, a bit more soil over Sooty. Then, oh! Eureka! Look at this, cried Sweep. Look at this! Gosh, said Sooty. A metal pipe. This might be worth a fortune. Come on, Sweep. Let's pull it out. But try as they might, they couldn't seem to budge it. Sooty had a think, and then came up with a sort of brainwave that only he can. Go ahead, said Sweet. Take it away. Yippee! Yippee! said Sweep. We've done it! Keep going, Sooty. The more pipe you pull out, the more money we're talking about. said Sweep. Well, we've certainly done something, said Sooty, but I'm not sure it's going to make us very popular. Well, you did say you were talking about real money when you were talking about scrap metal, didn't you, Matthew? Yeah, but I was talking about money coming in, not money going out. So, I mean, just look at all these bills. Look at this. We've got a washing machine, a tumble dryer, a tin bath to replace. They're all completely useless. All scrap metal now. And that's not the only scrap metal, because this metal detector is now scrap metal as well. What? You didn't realise all the things were connected? No, all right, all right. I know you were only trying to do your best. <laughs> Are we finished with scrap now? Um, well... Well, not quite, Sweet, uh, because whilst you were out, Matthew made a little purchase, didn't you, Matthew? Yeah, all right. I did, actually. I think you'd, you'd better come and have a look. In the yard. <coughs> mm -hmm. 
What's all this? <coughs> well, it's scrap metal. What was that, Matthew? Couldn't quite hear you. All right, too. It was scrap metal. Yes. Okay. And you've bought it, haven't you, Matthew? From a very shady-looking chap called Brian. D all right, all right. I did. Uh, what? You thought we'd finish with scrap metal? Well, we have finished with scrap metal now, but, I mean, th this was before I knew all about your disaster. Now, look at it, look at it! Yes, and we thought <sighs> there was going to be money in scrap metal. <laughs> what are we going to do? Yes! I'll tell you what we're going to do. We are not going to be beaten by scrap metal. <laughs> you go and get your instruments. Go on, musical instruments. Oh, and Scampi, hit those lights. No, we are not going to be beaten by scrap metal. As a matter of fact, on the contrary, we are going to do the beating. <laughs> you know, money isn't everything. And even if we can't sell all this scrap, at least we can have some fun with it. I'm going to show you that junk is funky. <laughs> what do you do with a pile of metal? Well, what on earth do you think? A washing machine, a fridge and a kettle, everything's here but the sink. One thing you can do is sling the lock, but I've got a much better plan. We can make music with what we got, yes we can. Okay, sweet, play that fast. Sue me that guitar, sing. Play those drums now! Hey! Now we are cooking, now we have started, everything's going just fine. Don't be upset. Be downhearted, feel the music blowing your mind. Take it in turns, do it one more time. Let the rhythm drive you insane. Just let it burn, makes you feel real fine once again. Okay, play that sex sweep. Sue, play that guitar. Here we go. Junk is funky, heavy metal, feel the rhythm pound. And don't you settle for any other sound. Okay, so do you play those drums now? Hey! We hope you've enjoyed yourselves at Sushi Co. If you have, we'll see you again soon. Bye bye! Hey! What do you do with a pile of metal? Well, what on earth do you think? A washing machine, a fridge and a kettle, everything's here but the sink. One thing you can do is sling the lock, but I got a much better plan. We can make music with what we got, yes we can.